everyone, I have Tanner here with me and we are practicing some sight words. So we just read this book, Daisy and Rosie, and this word appeared all the time. And so we're gonna practice writing a new sight word and remembering a new sight word. So sight words are really important for students to be able to recognize in a snap. You want them to get to that word, be able to recall it very quickly so that they don't waste time decoding it because they appear so frequently in text. So the best way to do it is read a book first and then practice the word together with um, reading and writing connected. So what we're gonna do today is a strategy called what's missing. So I have a whiteboard here and a marker. I like to write the word on a card or have it printed. It's just pretty easy to buy some index cards and some markers. Um, so I have the card here for Tanner and I'm gonna write the word here on the whiteboard. And I'm gonna ask Tanner, what does this word say? Yeah. Okay, then I'm gonna turn the board away and erase part of the word. Then I'm gonna ask Tanner, what's missing? What's missing? The E. The e. So at this point, you can either hand the marker over to the kid to be able to practice writing the end of that word, or you can write it yourself. Now, Tanner, we've been working on letter formation, and we've really been working on lowercase letters in words, not uppercase. And so I'm going to hand the pen over to him to fix the word. Add what's missing. Great job. So I'll just show you what he did. He added that E at the end. So you want to practice this a couple times. So if you have a few students in front of you, if you're a teacher, you can go to the next student and do the same strategy. Or if you have one kid, because you're a parent at home like me, you can keep practicing with different letters missing or even different words. So I'm going to erase another part. And I'm going to ask Tanner, what's missing? What happened? Oh, what? Okay, good. What's missing? The R. The R. Do you want to add it for me or do you want me to add it? Okay. Can you write an R right there? Squeeze it in. What were you doing? Were you adding an uppercase? Yeah. So he started drawing an uppercase letter and we want to really reinforce no. lowercase letters. So draw your, pull down. Oh. Okay, so we have our R in there, so that's here. So this strategy is really great for teaching new sight words to students because it has them recognize what part of the word is missing. And thank you 